everyone, and welcome back to Plants vs. Zombies. But first, a special message from Cringe Dev. <laughs> no, they lost the quality of Fog Man. Because I would hang around in the fog and jump out at people. <laughs> oh, no, well, hello. Here we are. It's night. We're in the backyard. There's a pool. We have... Oh, we have the Jack in the Box zombie. And this is fog, and it's going to obscure half of the half of the field, which is going to make finding out which row things are coming down lots and lots of fun. So, what should we do? It's night, so we'll take mushrooms, we'll take those as our basics ones, we'll take that because it's a freebie to put into the water, we'll take the walnut, and we'll take the tangle kelp, um, cherry bomb and squash for those stones when only those, oh actually, oh, let's have the doom mushroom. And as our upgrade, Let's take the repeater. Let's rock. Right there, so the first zombie's gonna come down there and get nobbled, which works for us. And we'll do the same deal. We'll put four mushrooms here, four mushrooms there, same as we've done with the sunflowers in these levels. Um, they're not gonna produce quite as much at the start, but I think they're gonna produce a good amount, and that's all we really care about. Just waiting for a little bit more light there, so we'll have one of those there, one of those there, one of those there. These work exactly the same as the, uh, the little puff shrooms, they just work in water, that's all. So, alright. First line of defence. Caught, uh, well, caught a half of our... Um, let's hold on to that for just a sec. I want to know where the zombie's coming, I'll put one there. There he is, and there that be. Okay. Put you there. Getting to the point now where we're making slightly more light than we're spending on these mushrooms, which is great because that's going to give us the advantage of putting down things like tangle kelp fairly quickly. In fact, not squash. Tangled up, let's get one of those in there. So that's our last one of those. You guys fight them off. And we can actually start thinking about putting some defenses in. Let's stick that there. And there's our last mushroom. Put you there. Uh, of course there's the cone head, so put you squash can deal with that particular problem. Just wait, oh there we go, there's our first mushroom room. Just waiting for this to fill up and we'll start putting down the silver walnuts. So we're gonna have one large wave, which is nice. There you go, that up there. We're getting lots of resources coming now. Oh dear. Give me squash. Where are you? There you are. Mm -hmm. Problem solved. Yeah. Probably lost some uh, sunlight there, but I think I can live with it. Right. Oh, we we'll get the last one of those in there. That's good. And we'll pop you there. We'll start getting some of these repeaters in now. We've got enough. Right, let's put the first one in there. It's going to be a convenient use. Yeah, and that sped things up quite nicely, I would say. So it'll be good. Oh, as you can see, it's probably going to be good for us if we can keep a. Um, a squash ready at all times. There we go. We'll get another one of these. Let's go for it. This 
it's making things harder, but not insurmountable at the moment. And we're coming up to the end. Place that tangle count. Final wave. So wave hello to the final wave. I think. Oh, what else have we got left? The speed it's going is probably swimming. Comes. Oh, I was wrong. Just gonna find one of these there and I'll take care of him quite nicely. Lantern! Lights up an area, letting you see through fog. And we'll have a play with that. Next level. Until then, I have been Simon Parsons. This has been Plants vs. Zombies. Thank you, and good night.